Let's have a talk about uploading documents in Microsoft Teams. So if I click on New Conversation and I can enter a post here and click on the paperclip, when I do this, I have a couple of options. In particular, I want to look at the difference between, say, browsing through the Teams library or uploading from my computer. If I choose to browse, I'll have a document potentially already stored in the file library. And when I go to do my post, I can simply click here to then go back, navigate through the library and click on the document. If I click here, for example, I'm choosing to share a link. So by browsing through the library for an already existing document, I'm actually choosing to link to the source document in that way. Whereas if I do a new post, do the paperclip and click on, for example, upload from my computer, it's actually going to upload a duplicate of that document and dump it at the top level into the file library in this particular team from that post. Let's take a look at the file library in the team. So when I go to the files tab, you'll notice that while there are some organized folders to begin with, there are a number of files that have just been dumped at the top level. Most of those will be through someone clicking to do a new post, the paperclip, and then just uploading a document from the post instead of coming in here and storing in the folder structure first and then going back to their post, doing the paperclip and browsing to create a link to the source document as I touched on earlier here.